in all of the whole wild world. Why did she have to come into mine? The name's Pickles. My friends call me Tommy, but you can call me Mr. Defective Sir. If you weren't the only defective in town, I'd... 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 Ooh, I'd go to another one. But you are, so... Please, can you help, Mr. Defective Sir? Drop the nice girl act, sister. Um, I mean, cousin. Every kid between here and the playground knows you're a big old meanie. Maybe so. But even I'm not mean enough to steal Phil and Lil's buried treasure. Oh, no! Phil and Lil got buried treasure? I didn't know they was pirates. They're not. Their treasure was an old bologna sandwich they thought was neat because it turned green. They buried it a few days ago, and when they came back to get it today, it was gone. But I didn't do it, really! Anybody who thinks I'd take a yucky old bologna sandwich is full of bologna themselves. You gotta help me get my good name back! I didn't know nothing about Mrs. Angelica having another name, much less you would've stole it. That sounded like a whole different case. But I knew that usually Mrs. Angelica and Treasure went together like a dyke bee in a bottle. Thing is, I also knew if there was one chance an innocent kid might have to do time out for a crime they didn't perpetrate, I had to help. I'll take the case. The case of the missing buried treasure. Part six of Let's Play Rugrats Mystery Adventures. Let's go back to home. Oh, well, I bet even Edison had to go to home heaven sometimes. Come on, kids. Home heaven. Hey, look, faucet accessories. Hey, school. Someone to play hide and go seek with. I've been playing just hide, but that isn't very fun at all. It takes a real long time. So count to ten and come find me. If you can. Well, I could probably find you. The hard part is counting to ten. Oops, I'm wrong. This is, this, this is part five. Oh, I kind of lost counting. Sorry for the mix-up, guys. Oh, look, I found the kid already. Pretty good, kid. You might be defective material after all. I can smell defectives a mile away. How? I got to clean diapy. <laughs> I like you, kid. You're funny. If you can find me, you can find a reptile bar, too. Bring me one, and I'll tell you a little something about that case you're working on. Reptile bar is coming up. And it's like that. If you need anything else, you know where to find me. Okay. Let's play the Dummy Bear Express. I hope we can. I hope we can get to the culprit soon, cause I have to go to the bathroom. Wow! This must be where the. Stupid game. Tommy's good at catch. Gotcha. Don't let that star twinkle on you, Tommy.
I was gonna play Shake It Up, babies, but apparently I've I went to the wrong one. Hey there. when you're a good hider. Now I can tell you some. Pick the clues that you think were at the scene of the crime. So it can either be a doggy cookie. Doggy cookie? A sandwich. A kitty cat. Click on the hat when you're done. A sandwich. Good defecting. You got them all. Next time we'll figure out who done it. See you later. Hey there. Now, let's find out who done it. Who's been nutty and who's been nice. Okay, let's put two and two together. We're basically three and three together. Extra three and two. Okay, doggy cookie, half a sandwich, and a cat. Everybody knows, everybody knows what animal that, that chases cats up trees. Who eats a doggy biscuit? And who would steal food? Answer? A sandwich stealing mutt! Spike! Got your red, uh, pod. It was you, wasn't it, Spikey? Confess. Okay, so I guess you're not gonna confess, but I know you did it. You drop your bone in the sandbox so you could carry the sandwich. You met up with the kitty and barked at it, accidentally dropping the sandwich out of your mouth and onto the ground where it got grass all over it. The grass made it taste yucky, so you left it there. But it still had your long full tooth marks on it. Even Mrs. Angelica's mouth isn't that big. Right? I guess you're saving it for the judge, huh? Thanks, Tommy. I'm not getting blamed for mean stuff I didn't do anymore. Just for the stuff I did do. See you around, kid. Wait, Mrs. Angelica. Aren't you forgetting something? Oh, yeah. Phil and Will wanted to say thanks by giving you the treasure. They say there's not enough bugs in it yet for them to keep it. Oh, no, no, no. I couldn't. It's their treasure. They said not to worry. They got lots of other fuzzy green treasures under that couch. Now I'm walking out that door, and you can't stop me. Why would I want to stop her? Of all the stuff Mrs. Angelica does, leaving is the bestest. So that was the end of the case of the missing buried treasure. Nothing bad happened to Spy, cause, well, uh, he's a dog. Mrs. Angelica stayed out of timeout. Phil and Lil were more satisfied clients. And me? I learned it's true what they say. One baby's treasure is another baby's disgusting fuzzy green sandwich. But if 